Do you like McDonald's ice cream stuff, like ice cream products? Like, like McFlurry? McFlurry? I like the McFlurry. Or the cone. Oh, oh I haven't had a McDonald's uh, ice cream in so yes. long. I, I do, and I, I know that their soft serve is, you know, it, it's quite mm. popular. It's unrivaled. It's unrivaled. It and is, I agree. Even yes. to the point where people know where the good soft serve it, you know, locations are. You know what my friend made me try to do? He, he he had french fries in a fucking soft serve, and then Ooh. he got me one, and he was like, all right, this is the best, and then you dip it. Yeah, you never yeah. tried that? I tried it with them, but it was so fucking weird. I didn't do it again, I though. I can't do it. The I don't dip, I just, off. like, I eat it, and then I'll eat it. Yeah, I don't understand that, that, I do that, though. No. It's sweet and savory, like, it's that. You don't eat sweet and savory stuff together? Like, what? I don't know, man, french fries are french fry. <laughs> Wait, isn't ketchup kind of, like, sort of a little bit of sweet? Tangy, yeah. Yeah. Do you drink soda when you eat fries? She's got you there. Wow. Boom. By the balls. <laughs> Take yeah, your shirt off. That's like, did We're you? We're playing strip facts. Did you, did you, <laughs> did you blend it? No, 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 leave it off, leave it off. Did you blend it? It was word. There we go. He wanted to take it off anyway. <laughs> he just gave him a reason. Even if you got it wrong, he'll take it off. I know, it's 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 a hot day. Tyka has a picture just like that. One more and you're fully nude, because it's just two pieces of clothing. Yeah, he's today. not wearing any shoes. I am wearing underwear today. Thank God. Yep. Good. Well, what's another thing that they're famous for with their ice cream? The fact that the it's always broken. It's always broken. And then they, take it, it. they take the cone from the ice cream. Instead of the cone. Oh, I gave her the answer. Yeah, the fact that it's no, broken. No, but I had to get it out. Oh, okay, okay. I don't even know you. No, they say they're cleaning the machine. All right. Do you, you know that people were doing the stupid shit? They would go order an ice cream, right? And then the the, the teller, I mean, the cashier will give it out like this, oh, and then they no. would grab it from the top oh, of the ice cream. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I, I, I saw this video. Yeah. It's fucking and then amazing. It falls on the ground. Oh my god, people are so dumb. So they pay for it just for it to drop? Yes, because they want to go viral. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. I mean, it's only a dollar. Like I'll do anything for views. <laughs> You're right. Do anything. We have. We have done everything. <laughs> yeah, we need the views. What's, what's I can't judge. I did some stupid shit. What's the number one thing that pops in your head that you were like, mm, that I was kissed kind of... a transgender woman that I was attracted to. Oh. And what's wrong with that? Nothing's wrong with it. Oh. But it wasn't, I wouldn't have done it if it wasn't for video. For views? Right. For oh. videos, yeah, yeah. But then I got to like it. That's good. And I did it. I brought, I invited her back to do it again. That's tight. Nice. To practice. Who, who was it again? I remember that. Her name was Kimber James. That's right. Kimber James. And she was um, pre-op. Oh, okay. For the... The first kiss? For the wiener. For the both kisses. Oh, okay. And uh, <laughs> But she had a big, big set of boobs. Oh. Mm -hmm. Just great body, you know? And uh, we kissed. And then I get an email, I think, you know, maybe a year later saying she had completed the, you know, and if she, if she wanted... Oh, wow. To, if I needed her for anything else, to let her know. So she was like, like for videos, you know. Oh, I was like, dang, you yeah. gave her a good business, kiss. Business, business, two business emails for business. <laughs> um, look, needed me for uh, anything uh, else. Ever, ever, sexuality, and I've said this before. It's like on a, it's a spectrum, right? So absolutely, you know, I'm not. I'm not the straightest. You just said you're the straightest. In, a, in another video, you said, said you're the straightest. That was in the last video. This is a different video. Oh, Fresh yeah, start. Okay. That makes sense. I'm, I'm okay. So if here's completely gay. Here's straight. I'm like. <laughs> Hang on. Why did you start on that side? Wait, well, just here, I'll, do, I'll be, start, the, I'll be the spectrum because we don't know yeah. where it ends. Well, it's over here. Okay. It's too far. It's out of frame. I'm somewhere, out of frame. I'm somewhere over here. <laughs> it keeps moving. I do, a, I, do a lot of, I do a lot of fun stuff, but it was mainly for comedy. And Steve, you know, for comedy, everything, sexuality is all, it's all on the yeah, table. Yeah, Bart's here. kids, several guys. Have you? Mm -hmm. yeah. Under the guise of comedy. Under I'll the do, guise. I'll do anything for comedy, yeah. Do them to, I'll do anything. Well. Anything for the joke. Bart would, Bart would honestly make out with you right now. He would. Well, Bart wants if to it was hold funny. his dick. If it, was, if it was part of a certain, yeah. Not me. I'm not a real comedian. <laughs> That's for science. Mm-hmm. Well, would you, you look him, great with your shirt off. Would you let him kiss you, Cassim? Uh, I mean, I would, but I like, because of COVID, it's because of COVID. Oh. Yeah. Otherwise, I would totally be on, on him. That's really sensible. Uh, listen, bitch, I'm right here. I You're would, not gonna be. I would be on him no. under guise <laughs> of comedy. <laughs> under the guise of comedy. Yeah. And right. we like to do three rehearsals before the real take happens. Yes. Right. With tongue. Yes. Because they're professionals. Yeah. You gotta nail They're it. method actors. Yeah. All right, back to McDonald's ice cream here. Of course. So, yeah. this 24 year old software engineer launched this website called McBroken, <laughs> which will. It has this map of all the McDonald's around the United States and I believe around the world too. How and many are there? Well, how come there's so many fucked up ones on the East Coast? 
Well, because there's more of them. Wait, so, do they work or? Okay, so green means that they're working oh. and red means that they're not. Okay. So. Damn, dude, from the Mississippi River and on, we don't got that many McDonald's. Yeah, so then here's LA. Wow, we have a, a shit ton of there. Fuck yeah. ton of Look, LA, this man. Is, this is all kind of bullshit, though, because I heard that the employees clean it at a certain time and then they don't want to have to leave it overnight and have to clean it again in the morning. So oh. that's why they cut it off at a certain point. That's what I have heard, anyway. But sometimes they really do just break and they're, they just sit there all broken and... I can attest to this because we have a soft serve machine and we know people that serve soft serve as well and those motherfuckers break all the time. Oh. They need to make a better machine. Yeah, the better ones cost as much as a car though. Okay. So that's why... But if it's your beast and you're very, Yeah, but when you're starting off, you don't got that kind of money. You start off with bootstrap money, okay? But why they're come, McDonald's. Why come McDonald's has the best soft serve though? Why come? Yeah. Cause it's not even milk. Yo, but have you had A and PM though? No. A and PM Where's soft that? serve is fucking good. Gas stations, Chevrons. Oh. You gotta look for one. Because I don't think they have A and PM How anymore. How do you not know what A and PM is, dude? Too I'm much not trash, stuff. dude. Wow. Good for you. <laughs> but yeah. So well, you don't know how to live then, cause <laughs> trash food is the fucking best. Well, yeah. So Rashik, the engineer who created this website, hey, and an he... Indian guy. Yes. Yeah, from of Berlin. Course. These Indian guys are taking all our jobs. And I've said it before. Thank you. Nobody says it. <laughs> no one says it. They're not taking my job because I have no competition. Uh, please keep doing what you're doing, uh, in nice Indian tech, smart tech guys. Yeah. But yeah, so what he did Start is. Start the new Instagram. He reverse engineered um, some software program stuff where if you were able to order an ice cream product, through the McDonald's app, then that's how you know that the machine is working. And if you can't, then that means the machine is not working. And so he was able to get gather that information from the McDonald's app and then make it into a website where every 30 minutes, so initially it was every minute that he was ordering like uh, an ice cream cone or whatever it was, and it totaled up to like $18,000 or something like that. Um, but then eventually the app ended up finding out that he, he he had a bot. It was a bot, not a human. So then he would How would they them check? Out. I guess the app just. It's the. It needed to do the yeah, like the traffic it. lights. It had to ping it. Yeah. If you know yeah. about servers and all this kind of shit, then you know that kind of shit. Yeah. So it knew that it was the same, like IP or whatever it is, ordering every single minute the wow. same item. And so wow. it just kicked him out. So anyway, the point is that he had a lot of trial and error, and then he concluded that it, the sweet spot is 30 minutes. So every 30 minutes, he's ordering an ice cream product from all of the locations. So is he ordering McDonald's. and canceling? Ordering and canceling? I don't know if he's canceling. That's a lot of money. Because it seems as though like he is. So he's ordering. Making I don't know. Fucking door well, getting that ice cream. Postmates or whatever the fuck. Maybe he is and canceling. He's getting, I don't like, know. They didn't clarify. Twenty thousand ice creams every day, every 30 minutes. Yeah. All over the world. I think the point he's using is a lot of money. I think the point is to just like make sure if he's able to even order it. So maybe if maybe he doesn't have to go through the thing. Oh, maybe it stops right before checkout. Yeah, probably. Mm, it's like uh, we have it available. Oh, this, right now, out of order. Is this yeah. guy okay? Well, he loves his McDonald's ice cream. Okay. Like he's I think dedicated. He's, um, like wow. He, he's thinking for the rest of us. Honestly, yeah, because in the past there have been like there was an attempt to try to do something along the lines of this where you can find out if the ice cream machine is working or not. But in the past, it was like user submitted. So you had oh, to submit shit. yourself to see like, like yes, it's working right now. But this one is like automatically, Automatic. you can go, if you're craving some McDonald's ice cream right now, go on that website and see if your local McDonald's has their machine working and it's, it's a really, Good website. You know what they need to do? You know how like uh, Krispy Kreme has their light on when there's mm. fresh donuts? Mm. They need a light on for the fresh fries because I don't want to go in there and get these fucked up fries. Bart has some insider tips. The oil. What so do you do? I, I had a buddy in high school that told me, so he was a assistant manager at uh, McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you had the hick, you got the hook on was huh? the, I, don't, I don't know how he got promoted, Damn. but he did. The assistant manager. Yeah. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> was it your oh shit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, all right. I mean, you know, wow, okay. Know. Let me, let me, Dude, let me, he's got the inside <laughs> scoop. Hang on, let me sit up, okay? Yeah. yeah. 
And uh, he was saying that the he's name dropping in front of us, right? Like <laughs> fucking flexing right now. Yeah, he was. Uh, he was it's funny because after our first guest, who's talking about Joe Rogan and stuff, and name dropping Joe Rogan and cool all these cool comedians and stuff. Yeah, like Bart's like my friend's assistant manager at McDonald's <laughs> at high school. He <laughs> wasn't even impressed the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's what we should do with these fucking Hollywood parties, man. It's like, yeah, I got a friend. Assistant manager at McDonald's. Oh, in corporate? Nah, like one of the yeah. locations the in real, East LA. No, the real deal. The real yeah. deal shit. Yeah. And uh, so they would change their what is it called? Oil. The frying oil once a week, on like I think on Mondays. And then so he he was saying that if you no on Tuesday. So if you want to get the best tasting fries, you got to come on Monday because then the oil is seven days old. Ooh. And that's when it's like really seasoned with all no the flavor. No wonder sometimes the fries oh. taste a little too clean. Like too clean, right? Don't yeah. some countries in the street, you know, the street food, they never change their oil. Yeah, I heard that too. Ew, never. Yeah, I watched some you video where heating it up. It's been going on for seventy years or something. Yeah, what? I'm sure Anthony Bourdain or Andrew Zimmern ate. Mm -hmm. You know, it's yeah. just it's like completely orange mm -hmm. or you know black, and it's just constantly like being boiled. Looking. I watched this one show where it was like a soup broth or something that's like 200 years old. Yeah. Like, yeah, they constantly, yeah, they constantly put new broth in and take it out, but they never, it never oh, gets depleted. Kind of like the mother dough when you make sourdough. Yeah, yeah. And, and they that never lasts for yeah. years and years and years. And they never cleaned around the sides, is because it had a bunch of shit, shit caked on the sides of it. You know oh, what I'm talking about? Oh, that's that. the Thai noodle soup one. Is that what that is? Yeah, yeah, that one's like 100 years old. I do the same thing with my coffee cup. I never wash my <laughs> coffee cup. I just put Steamy. nothing goes in it but coffee. So it's like seven. Years old. It's yeah. just brown on the inside. Seasoned. But I get that extra, you know? Mm hmm. A little bit of. There's a. Residue. Yeah. <laughs> Bacteria. Am I gross? No. Well, okay. Know, it's okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll rinse it. He's single, ladies. That's right. <laughs> Slide in.